hope you guys are fine in this video i will show you uh, how a pid based sine wave inverter works this is basically we are using arduino and we have a reference signal and we are manipulating pwm in using our reference signal in such a way that we are trying to get the same waveform using pid as the reference input so let's start the simulation then i will explain how this whole idea works as here this green signal is basically your reference signal and this pink one is your output and this blue one is the modified PWM as you can see that this uh, pink signal is trying to replicate this green signal which is your reference signal so as you can see here is some little disturbance and it's almost getting the same as your reference signal and you can also ask the question that why your pink signal is little um, getting away from the screen signal this is basically uh, because of hurry i did add the separating or isolated module or isolating components in the signal so if we add an isolating component this these both signals will be same and in, with no phase difference so it's a very close result as you can see here replicating and I will also show you a modified version of this thing let me just modify it over as you can see this is basically a potentiometer here here is a potentiometer this is your reference signal and this signal is going to your Arduino pin a node you can select a node a1 a0 as given you need so if I try to decrease my signal as you can see my as as you can see i am trying to decrease my green signal here which is my reference signal the pink signal which is the output signal is also following so let's just drop it further you can see it is following it the beauty of this circuit is that it follows basically the voltage and the frequency so if you change both voltage and frequency your output signal will be same as your input signal so this is the best example i have done so far in pid let me just distort it like as harmonics then you will see its output see it's exactly following as your input i hope you guys like this video and now let me share this how this thing works this is basically a simple um, inverter as here is the DC supply which is coming from the battery this is your IR2112 or you can use IR2110 or TLP250 depending upon your need and this is most of it is IGBTs and these IR2112 is basically your IGBT or most of drivers and this is the bootstrap capacitor and this is the transformers which is getting signal from both sides and this is a filter question which is converting your WM output signal into a sign signal and then we are seeing three things which is basically our reference signal our output and the PWM so friend this is the simplest example that I have shown you in this video and you can also get this so code 
and uh, this whole circuit and also the PCB design for this circuit too it's also available all you need to do is just to send a mail at tahmed45000 at the rate of gmail.com I will also provide a link in this in the description of this video you can also send a mail or you can download from there hope you guys like this video please like share and subscribe thank you